I can't believe today is Thursday, you guys. And I can't believe EnoCajor.com has been around for seven years. Like, it's so easy to say seven years, but it literally goes by like in a flash. That's my girl. I love me some good old fashioned Anna Nicole Smith from Mejia, Texas. God rest her soul. Get our flashy ready. Oh, you know what? I did make an announcement on Instagram about the flashy lamps. So if you guys want to hear that announcement here on Facebook, let me know in the comments below and I will also share that with you. It's not going to take it um, into effect for a while though, probably summer or fall of 2022, but it will change the flashy lamp eventually. It's going to look the same, but there's going to be one major change. Tell up. Brett Majors is here all the way from Australia. Good day, mate. I wish Rhett would come on live with us, you guys, so that way we could chat with Rhett. Thursdays with Rhett, live at the Bojangles Fantasy. Spill it. Spill the tea. I have um, pink press on gel in my nails with one coat of Dom Top and one coat of Wonder Gel. So, the big announcement in regards to the flashy lamp is that next year, it will, well not next year soon, but like in the future, is that it will uh, be battery charged. Battery powered. Rechargeable battery. Rechargeable battery, but it's gonna cost more though. Not, well, yeah, it'll, it'll be more expensive than what it is now, but it'll have a built-in internal battery that is rechargeable. Eventually. We're gonna bake that for one minute. I'm so excited. Just can't find. I think I liked it. Pull up the comments on my other phone because here I can't see anything. Spill it to me. Hello, Max. If I wanted a medium sized C curve nail, I would buy the square one, two, three, go, the sculpted square. If you want a deeper C curve, definitely go with the sculpted series. That's cool. Well, I guess it's going to get another flashy. But it'll still be a little while though. It's still very, very early in the production, and not even in production yet. It's a decision that we actually made this morning. I love this shape, so chic. Let's make sure the sides are nice and straight. So the promo code again, you guys, for a seven year anniversary with a 15% off is anniversary seven. And I just realized too, next month is the Orlando show. Who's going to the premier Orlando show? I have not heard that many people going. Cuticle now with the power bottom bits. That's it. That's all the shaping you have to do. Easy breezy beautiful. Let's make sure she's not wonky. Let's 
Why are all these songs like 20 minutes? I'm just gonna remove the shine very quickly. We have different lengths, so there's really no need to cut them, but you can, most definitely. You should open up a nail school. I don't know about that one. It won't be going to premiere. It is Rona Central. Nail things on the litter over the show. Yes, a company is buying the biggest plot and doing overkill flashing so instead of education for their products. I don't think that uh, nail boots are as flashy though as hair ones. The hair ones, they go, well, they used to go all out, but now I definitely think it is a, a dying pony trade shows. So the two colors we're going to be using today are BB Ombre 166 and 163, both from the Halloween collection. I think what makes it sad for me is that it's so ridiculously expensive to go to a trade show to exhibit we would spend tens of thousands of dollars and you're lucky if you break even especially for the bigger companies too some of them would spend you know hundreds of thousands of dollars and they're lucky to make that back that color though isn't she so creamy I think the only thing I miss about a trade show is the um, interaction with people the camaraderie but I'm sure that there will be other uh, circumstances where we get to see each other in person but I mean you guys see me every day on the internet so. and I don't think I'm that interested just an average Joe Beautiful. Let's go ahead and bake this for 30 seconds. Let's put on some of my favorite Jackson music. The least talented Jackson. LaToya. So we're going to use this glitter. It's so pretty. It has this very southwestern vibe. I don't know why I put it in the Halloween collection, but it's BB Ombre 163. And I think it's because I like reading the comments of the uh, LaToya Jackson lives. They're like, this looks like a horrible carnival cruise ship entertainment video mm, beautiful yes it's she sounds terrible doesn't she she can't really sing. She act he actually wrote it for her. But then he kept it for himself. But apparently I guess she would sing it in her concert in where was this in? Like Hungary or Poland? I think the only thing Latoya had going was her body. She had a really pretty figure. Latoya? 
I think all of them had the same, uh, had the nose job done around the same time. Because they all have that very signature nose. You can barely hear her. This is one of her original songs, it's called Playboy. So, before we put the stickers on, we're going to do a nice little coat of Wonder Gel, just to create a tack-free layer surface, if you will, and also slightly rubbery, and that actually helps with the adhesion of the sticker to make it more seamless. Cellophane thin. I think the mom has that same kind of nose job too. It's almost like she's speaking the song, isn't it? Let's take this for 30 seconds. gel polish and acrylic. It might be the top coat that they're using or maybe the lamp that they're using is uh, not strong enough so. Sue's here! There's a lot of different reasons why it could be chipping so it's hard to uh, determine one. So let us decide what stickers we're going to be using. Let's start off with because I wanted to look layered like the other ones that I did, if the camera would focus. I'm gonna put the leaves down first as the base, so that way I can layer the uh, flower on top.
lovely composition. And then I'm going to layer some more. To make it look more dimensional, layer them, you guys. And remember, don't put the stickers too close to the edge. If it's too close to the edge, it's easier for it to peel. So leave a little bit of space. Because when we put our velvet gel on top, it'll really make it look 3D, okay? been using emailcouture.com let me know in the comments below you guys Years, year and a half, six years, wow.
and this sticker sheet is the Russian Roses. Primer five years from this month. Wow. I'm using our famous nail primer very, very gently and lightly over the entire sticker surface, and this will help melt the sticker and blend in any edges. And what did they say? Did they jump on? With the air dry for a few seconds. Two years since the Florida class. Was that our first Florida class? I think it was. Four years from the Derry graduated nail school. Wow. One year. So let's make sure all the edges are nice and flat and melted in. So we're going to go in with one coat of Dom Top Thick Cartel Top Coat, which is, she's here somewhere. There she is. Remember you guys, stickers always look best under two coats of gel top coat. But if you're gonna do a matte or a velvet finish, like we are today, you only really wanna do one coat of velvet because two will make it too milky, and you'll, instead of making it look 3D, it'll just look very muted, if you will. So we're gonna do one coat of a shiny top coat, and then one of the velvet. Which style do you guys like better, shiny or matte? It's very beautiful. So let's get some Prisma glitter. And we are serving the FIFA World Cup fantasy today. All these FIFA songs. Really? Or isn't it? Uh huh. What? 
wasn't out when that came out. Well, they, they did. Really? Well, he is kind of tacky. What? So was that around the time that uh, the FIFA World Cup was happening? It was after? No, 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 the uh, Ricky Martin one. Oh yeah, this was 2010. When Ricky Martin sang the FIFA World Cup theme song, it was 1998. That was a long time ago. He must be pushing like 50 then, huh? He doesn't? For all the plastic surgery. So pretty. Turn upside down with itself a little out. Who sang the 2002 FIFA World Cup song? I don't think it was famous, was it? Let's bake it for 30 seconds. It's like dancing. Don't even know. Let's do, let's see, another FIFA World Cup song since we are on the uh, FIFA train. Or oh, the Russian one. Who sang the Russian one? 2018. And then I moved on from him. I'm not that big of a Ricky Martin fan. I only like a few songs. Yes, January 2020 was before the pandemic. I was a writer that I MC found really. What was your favorite? Wow, she's gonna come over to the dark side for Matt. I have to admit, you guys, for the longest time, I was never a fan of Matt Nails. But then I saw in Eastern Europe, they were really going hard with Matt Nails and stickers. And I was like, wow, that looks really pretty. And then we tried it, and I was like, whoa, where have you been all my life? Upside down, let's up level out. I'm a big Gloria Stefan fan. She's ready to do the conga. The monkeys. Weren't the, the Beatles before the monkeys? Big for one minute. Justin Timberlake, JT. Bad Bunny. She likes her bad bunny. To be honest with you, I have no idea what he sings.
had to get a sneak peek of what the nails look like, and they look so dope. Really, really stunning. It's like waiting for New Year's. Who is ready to see what they look like? Let's see what the FIFA 2018 song was. I guess it was Nikki Jam. I don't know who Nikki Jam is. Look at that fantasy, you guys. What do you think? Isn't that chic? So beautiful. The shape is really stunning though too. Look at that sea crib you guys. She is no joke. Let me take this off the tripod. What's my favorite kind of music? Super vintage. It looks like Dutch um, pottery. Like Dutch porcelain. my favorite kind of music? I don't know, I can't pick one kind. But I, I do tend to lean towards electronic or like pop dance music. Wow, so beautiful. And that's gonna wrap it up for today's demo, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget that promo code, you guys. 15% off your entire purchase with promo code ANNIVERSARY7 and that's gonna be a wrap for today's video I hope you guys enjoyed it I hope you guys had fun stay safe, stay out of trouble and I'll see you guys in the next one bye everybody actually no K-pop what? Mm -hmm. I don't think it was the top of my list and actually since the pandemic hit and I can't travel there anymore I don't listen to that much K-pop anymore but don't tell anybody So look at oh so beautiful I can't stop staring at them. Look at all the dimension. It really does look like it's in 3D, you guys. So stunning. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye everybody. Don't forget the promo code anniversary7. Bye.